is a health icon. I get the subsidized of food. Yes. Northern province. Yes. 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 Wapai Brookshire. Yes. Mindy Yes. All right. I. As you know, we are busy with uh, the interview, uh, a legacy interview with Umisis Nontle Mayosi. Now, we've just taken a break uh, from that interview. Uh, we have decided that in the meantime, let's have an interview with a firstborn son, Kamama uh, Unontle, Umisis Sipo Zulu Mayosi. Uh, you know, as the firstborn child, we sometimes just call them deputy parents because that's what they are. You know, um, they are the ones who get the best and the worst of parenting because we practice a Rakubo before, you know, uh, the other kids. So, um, welcome, uh, Khatep. Namtanje, Sizota story. Gombo Mibuga Mama. She's 85 years old. She is still fit as a fiddle. We uh, are Zenzela, Zongi Rafunu Zenzela. And uh, so we felt, uh, see Dr. Fundi Channel, Masize, Sizo Mamela Umama, Eteta Gombo Mibake, in her own words. I am Jibakubi Okumtu Palinwati, Gombo uh, but Siva, is, you know, guy. So, firstly, you are blessed to still have a parent who is around and alive and fit at age of 85. Mm. Now, I want you to reflect on Ubo Mibuga Mama in relation to you as the firstborn, but also to you. Uh, as the parents, uh, as, as the children, Bagamam. So, what does it mean? Ido uh, ba usakwazi, ba udle amazinda, no mama. Let me uh, thank this person. It's an honor and my pleasure to to get this few minutes to help with some few words. Yes. Uh, and this about your mama. Yes. Well, I'm going to go back uh, in the 70s. Yes. Yeah, we were still at uh, Ma. Yes. Yes. So, as it is traditional, uh, father would go and work. Yes. And mother would get home. Yes. 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 So, yes. so, yes. so it was just that like that. Yeah. So it was just like that. Uh, yeah. That I would go to work. Uh, Home, eh. making sure that the home is warm, yes, and welcoming, yes, to us as we come back from school or eh. even to Tata as he comes back from work eh. late, yes, yes. But I remember we had we still were still family friends even now, eh, in uh, Chabes, yes, yes, but we were staying not very far, yes. So there's a story that goes that uh, when I was still very young. I didn't like uh, food that is eating. Eh. Uh, so what I would do, uh, I would run away. Uh, I would get, yeah, I would get and go to the the, the, the Yes. Uh, get it under the bed. Eh. Uh, and I would go there and, and apparently now she knew that the girl should fight me. Eh. How about the girl? How about the girl? What job? Yeah, so that's how it was. Uh, and then uh, as siblings, well, it was myself and Bongali, then we were still going to school. Yeah. And then the others would follow later. Yes. Uh, but Umar was always there. Yes. Uh, yeah. She's always been the constant. Making sure that we have all the mm. necessities as children. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, I remember we were still using his late. 
in gynecology yes and obstetrics mm. yes. so we moved from Namakwe to Fort Nile Ekaya yeah, Kuhu yeah, yeah. it's Lali it's Lali it's a village but it was then considered as a town <laughs> yes the town of Ophia if you know it's a Dolopi yeah so we moved uh, from from Namakwe to to a Fort Malan in 1976. Yeah. And we went there to stay with our grandparents. Yes. Um, um, yes. Yeah. Uh, Reverend Mayos. And we joined others. We also there. It was a big number. Yes. Already we were six years, no? Yeah. Siblings. And, yeah. So, we, yeah. So, so even there, Umama, uh, I'm not sure whether whose decision it was. Yeah. <coughs> Uh, we saw, uh, in fact, there's a plan that we have some uh, extramural activities. Yes. So, for some reason, then, yeah, uh, we we started. Oh, we started to do <coughs> piano lessons. Yes. Uh, so I started. Why uh, you finish it? Keep, but we are poor. I pay. Yes. Under uh, Mr. Bongela, KS Bongela. KS Bongela, yes. yes. Uh, so every Saturday we would go to Bakawa eh. for, for, for piano lessons. Piano lesson. So uh, we ended up being pianists. Piano. So, <laughs> so, so, not a privilege, my daughter. Yes, <laughs> yes, yeah, yes, yes, so, yes. So, Mama was there every Saturday driving us. Yes. Yeah. Mm. Uh, we would also go to for some shopping, yeah. maybe once a month to East London. Uh, I remember one time we had a tire puncture. Yes. And Mama made sure that she's got uh, an overall. Chin. Uh, so. When we know I got to Mama. So. Now to be me, someone with Mama that I know. So she did. Yeah. So I'm the overall. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Chin. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, so she was that kind of a, of a lady. Yes. You know, who was independent. Yes, yes. Uh, so, so, but now, Ikale, Lokwel Kala, Le Mfundo. Ungati, you know, yes. for Wena, but also just for Nina, as yeah. I want to know about it. Ungati, Ikale, Lolak. It's a lot because uh, there was at some stage in Landuka. Who great, the great seven, the great six and seven. Yeah. They were a primer. Yes. But at some stage, but decide we know about China in high schools. Yes. We move a primer about China high schools. Yeah. So I was doing standard seven, which is great nine these days. Yeah. So we moved to get to, to, to the high school from primary to just to England. Yeah. And then to high school. But uh, I, I think since it was starting. Yeah. Process. Mm. Hey, uh, there was a there was a there was a gap. There was a gap. There was yes. A gap. Yeah. In terms of. Yes. Mm. So hey, not to and I don't know why some subject didn't have teachers. Yeah. So as a result, I remember that year, 1978, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Uh, we got a boy in the so I was a report. Eh. Um, I report the right heart. I was a coach or something. Mm. Okay, and then uh, I'm going to do a report. I was a pretty good say, that was a good call. Yes. So the phone report, hey, I'm going to be a good one. You! What is it? Yeah, you mean? You! Hey! 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 Hey
For some reason, such a traveler says here club bar, Mr. Joseph. Yes. I don't know why it's such a such a fort man saying that the club bar. Eh, why is that? 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 Yes, yes. 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 As a parent, he was, she was always there, mm -hmm. supportive, making a plan, uh, holding the fort while Sutata, Ayo Funda, and everything. Um, she's 85 years old, and she's still got all her faculties switched on. Ikalelo uh, Lakengoku. At, at her advanced age, we build a new, we need You know, yes, you are adults with your own families, but in Kalelo la kengo. No, look like any family. You see, there will be some. Yeah. Yes. 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 So, like a old child, you know, ask the ladies. Yes. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, yes, yes. Sometimes it's when it's born in Yes, 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 yes. yes. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. <laughs> she facilitates yeah, that family yeah, unity. Family, yeah. Yes, 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 yes. Well, we call her Lando, as a guy for my Yes, yes. I'm from Ovama. But just recently, I'm not going Eh, get the fort mala. They say in control. Eh, yeah. They say in control. Yeah. Yes, yes. Yeah, when they're in the arena, they're in the arena. Hmm. They're in the arena. Yes, yes, yes. No, so still very strong. Yes, yes, yes. So, ah, who review and check in with Chonga? That, that, but it's three words to describe Uma. Uh, three words nje, to describe her uh, as umzaligas, mm. you know, words uh, 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 of appreciation. Mm. No, she's very passionate about uh, family. Yes. You know, family units, uh, the extended family, of course. Yes. Price, dead end, yeah. back, mm. you know. So very passionate. Yeah. Mm. And also very supportive. Very supportive to you guys, yes, yes, and a unifier, yes, yes. No man, eh, Hatem, Masi Bambe up, so cut his pieces, Zalendo, as man as his Fagagule video, Gamam, yeah, con, eh, it was very important that as in Kulu, eh, Gamama, eh, and a de facto leader of the family, eh, go with Save uh, the you know, Uti Nukutomle and Gamma as a Bulla Kakulu Hate. Number Bulla. And goes, and goes, yes. Brilliant. Welcome back. Um, 
We are still doing the legacy interview of Mamunonte uh, Mayosi. Um, you know, we have interviewed um, many people. Uh, we've interviewed her son, Usipo. We have interviewed uh, her last born daughter, Unumisa. Now we are interviewing uh, Ukutala Smungile Mayosi. Uh, she's a middle child, very artistic middle child, uh, uh, Gamama. Now, like we have done with the other siblings, we just want to hear from Ukutala, uh, a reflector on Igalelo, that is the contribution, uh, you know, Gamama in everything. Uh, at Benene parenting, uh, support, and everything. So we're going to have just um, a short interview. Uh, no kutala. Makhatep, how are you? 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 You look anxious, man. And this is so easy. <laughs> This is so easy. I think this, this is an easy thing. You're talking about umtu that you've known for as long as you have lived. Umama mm. Right? Yeah. Uh, I think it's 55 years if the yeah, you know? I, I, she, she's, she's 85, I'm 55. Exactly, that's what I'm mm-hmm. saying. So yeah. you've known her for 55 years. It can't be that difficult to talk about her. Eh? Can no, it? No, no. Yes, so. So, Kaustelele about Umama in relation to you. You obviously are the firstborn daughter. So even though you are a middle child, but you still had a special place because you are the firstborn daughter. Um, but somebody else can say, no, because you are a middle child, uh, you don't have a special place. You know, it's yeah, only the firstborn and yeah, the lastborn yeah, that have special yeah, place. Yeah, so yeah. I don't know. But two, um, you know, males, um, and then a, a male and a female. So we are squeezed in by all these people. Wakula, Pagatu Kwabo, Ikalero lka mama, ego ni kulisen. Okay, it played a huge part in our. Tetanga uh, wengo ku, tetanga uwe. Yeah, no, no, it played a huge part in our upbringing. Yes. So there is a story. I want to start with. Yes. Okay, stories, stories. Yes. Uh, as a crafter, I'm not. Tell stories. Yes. Okay. okay. Yes. Yeah. Uh, we were moving from Fort Malan. No, 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 no. From Ngamak. Yes. When we were moving from Ngamak <coughs> to Fort Malan. Yes. So we had all these cattle, all these sheep and goats, whatever. Mm. Your parents were basically farmers, uh, animal, domestic yeah, animal, uh, yeah. you know, uh, farmers. Yeah. Cattle, sheep, goats, sheep, pigs, whatever, whatever. So people So my father, okay, my father was, was a district surgeon, mm. but he was always a farmer. Yes. And my mother was a, um, he was, he had taken a uh, back his uh, she, she my mother was 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 a a full time domestic she was an uh, uh, come again executive what? mom yeah. we call them executive ex- mom go yeah, we yeah. Or rana is yeah. Dosekaya. Dosekaya. yes yeah so she was not aware of what was happening all the time but she was always there mm. and then we had to move the the farm, yes. Fort Malan. Yes. Because my father uh, was now going to specialize 
in gynecology. In Natal, in gynecology. Mm. So we had to move the farm to from Namako to Fort Malan. Yes. So all the cows had to walk. Yes. Somebody had to Namakwe, head them. And some, somebody had to manage the whole system of walking the cows from Namako to Fort Malan. Yeah. So it Without was, losing any of them. Yeah, so it was my father. Yeah. And I can't remember how old I was, but I was involved in this yeah. system of moving the cattle mm. from Fort Malan because uh, there, there, there was headman. Yes. He... Uh, shepherds. Shepherds, yeah. Yes, or headmen, yes. Yeah, shepherds that had to walk the cattle. For that distance of almost 100 it, kilometers. It, yeah, it took three days Yeah. to walk the cattle. So we, we were in Fort Malan, and then we, we were driving every day mm. to bring them food With and then dead. to check if they are fine and mm. the cattle... It took three days. I thought, yo, this is something else. Yeah. This, it just, just something else. Yeah. Yeah. So I have always, always thought, yo. and my mother, she would cook and pack the bags for mm. the headman. And then we were taking the, 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 the bags to the, We're going back and forth. Yes, you know. Making sure about... Replenishing food supplies, going back, cooking, replenish yeah. for all those three days. Yeah, mm. making sure that the cattle, all the cattle, the sheep, the whatever, whatever... Goat, chicken. Yes, mm. this was walking. Mm. They, they, great they, trek they, uh, from they, Namakwe they, to yeah. Fort Malan. It, mm. it, was, it was really the great trek. Mm. Because imagine... So many, it, we had so many cattle, mm. so many uh, sheep that were walking mm. from Namakwe. It's how mm. many kilometers from Namakwe? That's to why I'm, I'm estimating 100 kilometers or even more. It's more. Yeah, right? yeah. it could it's be more. more. Maybe it could yeah, be about 150, but not more yeah, than that. Yeah, not more than yeah. yeah. But but it 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 took long. It was just unimaginable. Yes. How you can walk the head of cattle. Yes. So now could one place to the yes, other. Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Mm, mm. Mm. Firstly, as a firstborn daughter, uh Kamama, how strict was Umama Eku Kulisin? You know? How in, in the in, in, in the upbringing. Because remember Umama Uh, and those professions were strict professions. So you must have experienced it, especially being the firstborn daughter. Yeah, I know. She was, she was very strict. Um, she had... Um, she, 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 she introduced measures whereby... Um, So I'm yeah. Okay. So so I think she they 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 were they were belts. Yeah. So the these belts were my father's belts. Yeah. So uba umoshile. Punishment. Uzo betwa. Ne? Yes. Uzo betwa. And lama bandi. It, it depends on your on how you have uh, a yes. so each belt so was each there belt depending on, on on the magnitude of the wrongness of, yes yeah, but that you so, did yes so lama mm. bandi ngakatata ne but ubethwa ngumagogo ne so umagogo yes. uzawuyazba okay this one and then Yes. My, 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 my younger sister would say, Yo, I would run to my mother because my mother knows what are the measures 
the punishment apekaya utata 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 is 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 going is is utata was was our dad yes he was soft he was everything yes. but umama no was strict ah that's why why go veveza yes why she was she, she would was talk just a lot a, a and lot also discipline and, you and guys and then discipline so it is it disciplinarian was yeah. there so she was the executor of it discipline yeah. who dad was you know good cop bad cop they both <laughs> agree uh, you know in the in their bedroom that we are going to discipline these kids but, but one of them is going to be the bad cop yes, the other one is going to be the good, good cop one. Yeah, yes. yeah he was he was forever forever Utoko. not not that he was mm. not encouraging mom Uh, ah, to do we institute don't know what, discipline. We don't know what they are. <laughs> they, they are. Yes, yeah, no, yeah. I would, I would, I would go to the times is a separate. Yes. Okay. We were in Mtata, in Amakwe, in Bai, in Fort Mala. Yeah. But I would go to Udogo. This is Udogo. Did need a this and this and this. He would just write a check and then go. Yeah. yeah. So, but my mother was doing the book. Yeah. Yes. So umama aboni is checks. Hey, siya kutala. Yongi tu ya kutala. Yeah. Kutala this, kutala this. Yeah. Ah, why is he why late? Eh. Because money is checks, already cashed. It cash you, it cash you check. It cash you uh this 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 kutala 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 mm, okay. this. Okay. So you yeah. were spoiled basically. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Now, um let's just reflect on umama in terms of your career choice. Uh, not many parents would allow their kids um at least those days to mm. choose the art side of things you are the you 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 one of the kids uh, in the family that is very academic who chose from the beginning uh, whilst others are academic na i want to focus on art how did you do that uh, how, how did you even manage to convince Uh, these academic parents to actually allow you to spread your wings in the in in the area of art fine art uh, and now you are a qualified fashion designer no because they allowed it yes they created an environment yeah they created that environment yes when we were growing up we were allowed to spread our wings yes as you say yes. yeah So I took that chance. I was looking for a short just the easy easy way out. Yeah. But but I I really mm. uh, I enjoy I, I enjoy what I do, what I do. Yes. But my mother, my mm. mother always had a sewing machine. Yes. The one that she used to 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 as you guys were getting your hand your hand me downs, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes, yeah. Yes. 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 So so yeah. So okay, we yes we had uh, she she had a sewing machine mm. that I would uh, uh, use yeah all the time yes to make my small projects yes yes but so basically you were familiar. <laughs> with yeah. the use of machines to create stuff yeah. you yeah. know so it did not look like something that is a, a huge challenge for you yeah no yes. no, okay. no no it, it oh. was it wasn't it yes. wasn't yes it, it so. wasn't so that's that's where it all started yes but we were always encouraged to dream yes we we had such big dream things. and follow through was the dream yeah, alone no, without no, yeah. action is yeah, nothing yeah, yeah. it's a dream with a follow through we had such big dreams and yes. we would follow through and we would it was mm. yeah it, it through throughout even mm. okay i would i would um, just take a task yep yep biking yes we had, we had bicycles mm. bicycles so we would take those bicycles yeah we would, uh, challenge we do challenges yeah ah elalini 
Yes. Yeah, it was not my mountain bikes. Yeah. It was just e bicycle. Yeah. But we would do challenges, we would do so many things. Yeah. And so you guys had got a balanced upbringing though, because there was a bit of urban, there was a bit of rural. Yeah. You know, uh, Ngamako mm. was a bit urban, Mtat mm. was a bit urban. But you also spend a lot of time uh, at Fort Malan, which Malan. was deep yeah. rural. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And that created a balanced person. You guys could fit, you know, either urban or rural. Urban or rural. Yes. Yeah, so but then we know because those days, if you are a, a doctor's child, uh, people had high expectations about this and that. Mm. You know, what in and uh, you mm. guys used to meet as doctor's children every month. You know, at the different homes. How yeah. how did that you know affect you? Did you guys see yourselves as privileged? You know, no, uh, but, and all but of that. We, we didn't know. We didn't know the power of being a doctor, a doctor's child. Oh, yes. we actually were not even aware. Our our father was a doctor. Did, yes, it didn't make you aware about that. No, yes, we didn't yeah. know. Our father was a, was a. Okay, we knew ungu ungu doctor my youth. But what does that mean? We didn't yeah. know when yeah. we grew up. Yes. Gina. Yeah. As a result, when when I got lost in Durban, I didn't know he. My father is Doctor Mayus. I thought my father is Doctor Pupuma. Yeah. Because we used to hear about Doctor Pupuma and Mama. Yeah. No, who wanted to buy the town? Yeah. Is the doctor so? But we knew he. Our father works with Dr. Popuma, but yeah. we didn't know. Yeah. What does that mean? What yeah. does, so yeah. we, he, he never stressed why now. Yes, okay. So we thought we are just ordinary. Ordinary kids, yes. Yeah. Okay, but mm -hmm. let's leave it back to Mama. So mm -hmm. if I'm asked, you know, Mama has gone through some, some, some losses in her life. Uh, Mama is still standing. Mama mm -hmm. is still looking at guiding you guys with this and that. What two things can you say you've learned from Umam as Ugneta to navigate Ubum? She is a very strong... Yeah. 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 She's very strong. And then... Emotionally strong or strong uh, in terms of personality? No, she's strong in all all, all aspects. aspects. She, she is. is. She, she leads. Yeah. She leads. She's a leader. Yeah. yeah. And then she... She... she our, our mother is... She, she, she takes over. Yeah. She... She's a doer. She, oh, she just... Yeah. Okay, she, she's a doer. She's resilient. She is. She's everything. Yeah. When when you are down. Yeah. She's the person to talk her. to. Just just talk to her. Then when she comes, she takes over. Yeah. She will manage mm. any situation. Yes. Yeah. She's yes. that kind of a. Yeah. Of a she at, at home now. I thought I thought actually she was the one who's a mayosi. Yeah. She she is in charge all the time. She is the one that um, that is there to manage any situation actually. Yes. So yes. when we are down there's no one to call mm. but her. Yes. To take over. Yes. Yeah. Beautiful. In our in our families. Yes, yes. So um what has been her role in helping you to parent your own children? Uh, because until we roll, we are we we take the, we we we've patent patented her parenting skills mm. for our own children. Yes. Yeah, because. Uh, it's so you, she, it's there's it's a template that a she template, yeah, yeah okay, okay so simple. you are implementing her template it, it's simple it's just you must just be present as mm. a parent yeah that's all mm. if you are present then you can bring up the next generation yeah of of children yes 
Yeah. Yes, yeah, beautiful, beautiful. So, um, what is one thing, one thing that um, when you think your mom comes to, to your head? Humility. Humility. Mm-hmm. Can you explain what that means? Just to be humble, uh, to love. Um, it's it's just to 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 take any situation as it is. Yeah. And what it presents. Yeah. And um, make your way. Make make just make. So so well, if life gives you lemons, lemons make yeah, lemonade. Make make lemonade. J. Yeah. Yes. That's, that's just. Yes. How it is. Okay. Beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful. Mm. Okay, Kutz. I'm not gonna take um, more time. Uh, there will be a day where I'll be interviewing you for longer. Uh, so I just wanted to get a sense of mm. when you reflect on Umakoko. Yeah. So you've shared those. Um, and um, what do you think about us capturing her story? It's just beautiful. Mm. When I say beautiful, it's, it's because in life we want to create beautiful moments. Yes. So those moments yeah. will stay on as beautiful. Yeah. Thank you very much, Kutz. Siabule. Okay. <laughs>